And what we're doing today is talking about hepatitis C, a disease that has the potential to cause debilitating illness and can lead to the need for liver transplants in some cases and in fact can be fatal. Treatment for hepatitis C, uh, these treatments are continuously advancing and with recent new drugs we can now cure many people suffering with this illness. That's why I'm uh, really pleased today to announce that we've provided five million dollars to the St. Paul's Foundation to support the BC Center for Excellence in HIV AIDS research into hepatitis C. I think that the, the data that we're going to gather over the next couple of years uh, working together with our colleagues throughout the system uh, is going to give us unique insights on how to move the treatment prevention strategy to viral hepatitis in a way that is sustainable and ultimately contributing uh, to the sustainability of our health care. What I'm very impressed with today is that the BC government has shown leadership. They're in fact making significant investment in research, but more importantly, this will allow us to offer hepatitis C treatment to some of the most marginalized and vulnerable hepatitis C patients in our community. A lot of us will, I quit smoking because I'm, you know, I continue to stay clean because I don't have hep C. You know, I've gone out and actually got a job and show up every day on time, right? You know, these are things I didn't do when I was carrying that weight in my mind of having hep C. Anyway, um, yeah, life's different. And, no, thankfully, there is a cure today. Thanks.